Alright guys, in this video I'm going to be teaching you how to use um, splitting the throttles in War Thunder. Um, so it's actually pretty easy to do. You need to go to your key binding, which I'll do here in a second. And once you get to that key binding, here in a second, give me a moment, um... Splitting the throttles here, I'll explain right now, is just kind of more for a cool trick to show than to use in an actual dogfight because it's um, not the easiest to do while in the middle of a dogfight. Right there, the only reason I didn't go flying is because I have my brakes button equipped. But about two days ago, I added um, that splitting the throttles thing so what you're gonna want to do is i'm gonna leave my plane because i'm at a weird angle so i'm gonna go ahead and take off you know just normal take off with the wings all the way out and then with the yaw and pitch buttons you can actually do a cobra what you're gonna want to do is go to controls go to full real controls or yeah, full real controls. Go to manual engine control and select engine control mode. You're going to need that. You're going to want to switch that on. And then go down to the first engine, second engine, third engine, fourth engine, or fifth engine, sixth engine, depending on how many engines you want to be able to control at one time. Then once you bind those... You could just go back to your normal game. Don't worry about that. You could just click out of all of that. But once you do that, you can, you, what you should do is switch your controls, then idle your engines, select what engine you want, and then full pro, full throttle or emergency power afterburner. And then you could switch what mode you are in so that you could pull something like a Cobra. And then you could do a cool trick. Or you could try and win a dogfight better. But as you can see, if I switch to more reality controls here in a second. Compared to the point aimer that you normally use. Um, you'll actually go further to the left or further to the right depending on what engine you use. And then if I tr pull a Cobra, I'll do a little spin with it, just like in uh, Top Gun Maverick, if you've ever seen that. But, um, yeah, that's how you could split the throttles in War Thunder and pull a few um, cool tricks. And I'm going to recover this, right? Yeah, nope, okay. So we are just not going to talk about what happened for the next five seconds. All right, five, four, three, two, one. All right, we don't talk about anything that happened in the past five seconds, ten seconds. Anyway, so um, that's it for the video. Um, Yeah, as I said, doing this in a real battle isn't the most convenient. But it can help a little bit with a dogfight, and it can just be a cool trick to do around your friends. But yeah, that's the video, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!